The atmosphere is filled in as two sides worthy of the biggest stage get ready to clash in front of a packed stadium. All the action here on EA TV. Well, a very warm welcome to all joining us at Anfield. I'm Guy Mowbray, and alongside me for commentary is Sue Smith. And a live game from the Premier League on the way, it's Liverpool, and they play Bournemouth. Cheers, Guy. Well, it's a pleasure to be here, and I'm anticipating a good game today. The coaching staff have done all they can. Now it's about taking it onto the pitch. This is the Liverpool starting lineup. Allison is in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Ibrahima Kanate as centre backs. And the main striker is Diogo Jota. Here's the Bournemouth lineup. Yeah, a 4 5 1 or a 4 2 3 1. A lot of coaches are adopting this nowadays as it does give you those two holding players while you've still got plenty of threat from the wide wingers. Enjoy the game. Off we go, the match is underway. Diaz and the work pays off as they get the ball back there's a good amount of freedom here using his body well to keep the ball Luis Diaz this looks promising from Liverpool Diaz. Great defending. And this could be. And a really good bit of goalkeeping to keep that out. Keeps himself in the way. Well held. A turnaround in possession. Excellent positioning. Not getting close enough here. Could get it over now. Good work to beat the challenge. Asking quite a lot to score from there. And that's missed by quite a bit. Oh, no. What's he doing there? That's an opportunity wasted. It's got to be a perfect shot to beat the goalkeeper. And that wasn't. Unsurprising who we've singled out as our player to watch. What should we expect today, Sue? Well, that sort of form speaks for itself, doesn't it? To score three goals in his last three matches, he must be full of confidence. All the best keeping him quiet. Now, can he get the crossing? Well, not quite fully away here. And that must be so disappointing for them. A goal at Spurs. Over to Alex Scott for more. It's a goal for Spurs. The goalkeeper did all he could, but no one was going to stop that one. They've scored the opener with 13 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. <laughs> and
And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick to come. Well, lots of us have been talking about it. Now the transfer has happened. What do you make of the move, Sue? Yeah, I think it's a good transfer. He'll certainly add quality to the squad. And it's important that he starts well just to help him settle in. It's a good bit of business, though, I think. Promising looking ball. And that will ease any defensive worry. That's a lovely ball. There might be something building now. Jota! It's there! That changes things. A goal for 1 0. And it's so impressive how quickly they go from back to front. And what a finish this is. Such a difficult technique. But he makes it look so easy. And that's an amazing finish. rolling again Diaz beautifully weighted ball and there's the whistle it's a penalty to extend the lead and if there were any nerves they didn't show a well taken penalty well we can see it here again he's given the keeper the eyes sent him completely the wrong way makes for a relatively simple finish in the end but it's a good penalty this as the ball gets rolling again Cook and the attack is over really good defending could turn out to be a really good ball near where it needed to go and that one goes out and away Liverpool trying to get things moving. Well, ambitious effort, and it's a good diving save, although one you'd expect to be made. They take it short. He takes it on. Excellent work in goal there, well saved. Alexis McAllister. McAllister. They are sitting a bit too deep here. Good patient builder. Driven into the box. Back off the post. And the attack comes to an end. Disappointing. 
Well, the woodwork just about keeping them in this. It has been chance after chance, though. You just think if they score another, you fear this could get ugly. Hugo Jota. Diaz. And the defence has done its job to stop any trouble brewing. Lewis Cook. There's a sense of real urgency to this attack. The comeback could be on here. Well, he went for power and got plenty of that, but was never anywhere near. Space to attack here for Liverpool. Alexis McAllister. Could be something building for Liverpool here. But that's where any chance of anything developing disappears. Good work to regain possession. Luis Diaz. Nicely sets it up. Great chance here. And the keeper's done really well to keep that out. Well, that will do it for the first half here at Anfield. of all the players we're watching today, would you agree that he'd certainly get good marks so far? Yeah, it's been a good performance overall. He certainly took this penalty away with real confidence. It's just whether he can add to that now in the second half. And we're off for the second half. Justin Kluivert. Ivan Nielsen. Well, it did look promising, but threat averted. That's not a bad-looking ball. Decent chance, this. Well, that's what he's there for. It's a good stop. Well, if that had gone in, I just couldn't see them getting back into it. They'd been far too open at the back. Conceding chance after chance. Well, we have more cup tie football coming up for you here on EA TV as Liverpool face Tottenham. Really hope you can be with us for that. Yeah, they're away from the pressures of league football. A chance to progress through to the next round. Should be an exciting game. Could be something happening for them now. And that's good goalkeeping in a difficult situation. Alexis McAllister. On to Luis Diaz. Alexis McAllister. On to Luis Diaz. Looking for someone at the back post here. Oh, it's a nightmare for him, that. It looked a really good chance to score. Liverpool have it back now. Down nicely and in. And that is a quality bit of 
goalkeeping. As the stats show, you just wonder how many this could be because the way that they go forward, it's great to watch. So much creativity and the defence just can't cope with them. Surely the manager will make a change soon. The crowd urging him to shoot. Yogo Jota. That's a free kick. And you couldn't choose many better spots for one. comfortable for the man in goal well this has been a really strong performance hasn't it they've created lots of chances this time it's unlucky not to go in but I still think there's more goals in this now there could be a chance to counter still trying to find the space that's gone behind goal kick Elliot. A little bit deep with the approach now. It'll come their way soon. The ball taken away from them. More knockout football for you to enjoy on the way on EA TV as Bournemouth face Newcastle. That's one surely not to be missed. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Both teams are going to be looking to progress, that's for sure. Hopefully it's going to be a competitive match. Freedom here. And a cross that could be dangerous. The danger averted for now. Harvey Elliott. Gravenberg. Gravenberg. Move of real promise now. Ryan Gravenberg. Elliot. And they need to be better on the ball than that. Timber. That's a lovely ball. There might be something building now. This to get back into it. It's missed. And they surely won't get a better chance. I don't think they will, Guy. That's a great opportunity to get themselves back into this game. I can't see them getting many more now. Van Dyke. Ryan Gravenberg. Tidy in possession there. Elliot. A 
approaching the last whistle here and Liverpool have really been on it. This will get a great reaction from the fans. Yeah, they've clearly been the better side today. Composed and clinical up front. They've moved the ball around quickly with quality and the defence did their job. I'd say it's a good all-round performance so far. Sinistera. They've lost it there and the attack is over. Shot brings about a routine piece of goalkeeping. That's not the best distribution. And that was passed towards the goal, but it's wide of the target. Luis Sinistera, Quinton Timber, he's hit that well, and that's not a bad save at all. Ball comes in, and he's done really well to keep that out. There is the final whistle. Plenty of positives for them to take away, not least the three points suit. Yeah, it was a fairly comfortable result in the end. They control large parts of the game. It's a real professional performance, and I think they deserve the results. Well, we know just what a good player Diogo Jota can be, and he's looked pretty good today. Yeah, I thought he played well, got his goal, could have had another, but he linked play well today and got into dangerous positions. I'm sure he'll be happy with that.